being gay isn't such a straight thing, especially in the third world country. Wah! Hi, I'll do it and welcome to this edition of Simon Says So Gay People. Okay, those people that religious people think are full of demons. My child is gay. Oh, Jesus! Lord have mercy! The Lord should also have James, John, and even Peter. He loves all the kids in the world, even the boys. Come here, boy! Ah! When you mention the word gay to someone who's straight, they immediately start thinking of butt stuff. Mataco! Wrong one! Yeah, we straight people immediately go sexual when someone says that they're gay. Then the brave ones ask, how does it feel? Do you have constant diarrhea? And are you the guy or the girl in the relationship? Those are the questions that run around my mind when someone tells me that they are gay. We are sexual beings, but there's a lot more to a relationship than just sex. Can you imagine what it would be like if relationships were all about sex? There'll be no need to talk. We just meet and say hi. Hi! And then if you want to see each other naked, we just jump into it. Then one minute later, the relationship is over. Uh, some of us last longer than one minute. No way, you have a one hour relationship. Yeah, we almost fell in love. Ew, what's that? It's some tingly feeling that you have in your body when you see someone. Oh, so it's kind of like the feeling that I get when I pee on myself. Exactly, and you feel warm when you pee on yourself. But it gets cold really fast afterwards. Same thing happens with love. It's warm at first, but it quickly gets cold. So pee on yourself so you can see what love feels like. A relationship involves a lot more than just sex. It's a lot more than just playing around with someone else's body parts. Because attached to those body parts is a mouth that feels the need to say words. And words come from saliva. And saliva is key to foreplay. So if there are bad words, then there is bad saliva. And if there's bad saliva, then there's no foreplay because nobody wants to kiss someone with bad saliva. <laughs> Even though we all know the most important part of any relationship is communication, we don't really care much about it. Yeah, you don't hear things like, <gasps> they broke up because they couldn't communicate. No way. Yeah, he was dead and she was saying all the wrong things with her hand. I love you! <laughs> but we honestly just care about the sexual aspects of relationship because people want to hear the juicy tidbits. And the reason why the tidbits are juicy because they're covered up with bodily fluid. But the real juice of any relationship is indeed communication. So next time you hear that someone is gay, well, don't let your brain run off into some quick butt stuff. And for ladies, lip stuff. And many other stuff that people do to each other. Let's focus on the things that truly matter. Love. Ew, what's that? It's some tingly feeling that you feel when you see someone. It's kind of like that feeling I get when I pee on myself. Exactly. And that's wrap up with this edition of Simon Says. So make sure you bam, bam, bam. Figure me with a like. Bam. Another like. Another like. Another one. Figure me with another like. Just right down there. I love it when you do that. Make sure you leave a comment and kind of like there. Matt did it. Matt, you did it. You can do it too. All right. Just go. Figure me a comment. Finger me a comment with your very active fingers, okay? That got you onto this video in the first place. So please do that. And please share this video in a way to spread what real love is about. Look at me, Mr. Love, Dr. Love. Someone hired me already about love. Anyway, there you go. Spread to someone who made you to hear this. And on that note, Simon says, out.